Hi, I'm Juliana Hever and this is the What Would Juliana Do Q&A. Today's question is, the infamous, where do you get your protein on a plant-based diet? People are on a quest to find the most amount of protein possible. I was like that when I was a trainer. I was always asking people where they were getting their protein and reminding people, make sure you get your protein. Yes, we need protein. It is an essential macronutrient together with carbs and fat. And we need it because the amino acids that it breaks down into are the building blocks for essentially every single structure and function in the human body. But just because it's good and we need it doesn't mean that more is better. High intakes of protein, especially coming from animal sources, are linked to gout, as all sorts of different chronic diseases like cardiovascular disease and certain cancers and it's taxing on the kidneys. So how much do we need? We need about 10% of our total calories to come from protein. The Institute of Medicine's RDA for protein is about 0.8 grams of protein per kilogram body weight per day, and that's for an adult on average. Now, if you're pregnant or breastfeeding, if you're an athlete, you may need upwards of 1.2, maybe 1.4 grams of protein per kilogram body weight. So the average person really only needs about 0.8 grams per kilo. And if you calculate that out in terms of how many calories you're consuming, it ends up being about 10% of your total calories. So where do you get protein on a plant-based diet? Well, even the quintessential starch, brown rice, has about 11% of its calories from protein. Even the lowly banana has about 5% of its calories from protein. And if you look at leafy greens, they have about 40, 43% of their calories from protein. Essentially, it's not very easy, if at all possible, to not get adequate protein from a whole food plant-based diet. Just make sure you're eating your foods from whole sources. Plant-based superstars of protein in the plant kingdom are beans and legumes like lentils, soybeans and their products. Nuts and seeds are wonderful sources of protein. Nut milks, plant milks, uh, leafy green vegetables, it's really ubiquitous in the plant kingdom. So just eat a nice wide variety of whole plant foods and you don't have to worry. If you have a question you'd like answered or if you're interested in nutrition counseling, find me online at www.plantbaseddietitian.com, on Facebook as at Plant Based Dietitian and on Twitter as at Plant Dietitian. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time.